Thanks, Josh. The Turkey Day Classic is one of the nation's oldest HBCU football classics. And joining us now, the university presidents, Dr. Quentin Ross from Alabama State and Dr. Charlotte Morris from Tuskegee. President Ross, we're going to start with you. <laughs> Tell us, this has been a game people have been waiting for. Listen, this, this story game, history uh, cannot... Uh, we cannot overstate how important it is to the state of Alabama, uh, to both of these historic institutions, to Tuskegee University and Alabama State University. And Dr. Morris, my good friend, president of Tuskegee, you know, we set out to make bring this tradition <laughs> back uh, to Montgomery. And so I'm just so excited about the opportunity to uh, continue this tradition of almost 100 years that we've uh, played one another. Uh, we, we've had uh, some good times and bad times together, uh, made some friends, uh, uh, but we're excited about what's happening and what will take place on tomorrow. Do you have a favorite Turkey Day Classic memory? Well, listen, Turkey Day Classic was actually my homecoming when I was in school, and so I can remember not being able to go home uh, for Thanksgiving, <laughs> and uh, we were playing in Crampton Bowl, and, and of course, uh, we, we were doing very well, uh, particularly back in the 1990s when I was SGA president, when we went all the way to the HBCU uh, championship. So uh, that's, that's a great, great memory. President Morris, how has the atmosphere been on campus this week leading up to the big game? Exciting, that's the word, exciting. Our kids are very much excited about the game. They are talking back and forth, of course, on social media. <laughs> yeah. And, and uh, so we are very excited about being here again and, and reactivating this classic that has been so important to both Tuskegee and Alabama State. Our students, many of our students are legacies and so they have come to the game as children. So now they are students at either Alabama State or Tuskegee, so they look forward to this particular game. I know that this is your last Turkey Day Classic as president. What are your feelings? <laughs> well, I must say that it is bitter and sweet for me at this point. I um, enjoyed my experiences at Tuskegee, and but I look forward to going to the Turkey Day Classic when I'm not on 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 on, on display. <laughs> yes, I yes. Say, because you know, being a president, you're always on on call wherever you go. So I look forward to the time I come to the game and I am not on duty. <laughs> <laughs> Love to hear that. And the best of luck to both of you all. Yeah. I know that it's going to be an exciting time come tomorrow. Yeah. Lots of festivities yeah. going on and just a electric atmosphere. Yeah. Indeed. We are we we are not friends at the moment, <laughs> but we will be after the game tomorrow, regardless of who win. And that's that's kind of the general consensus of both teams and both groups. We are we talk a lot of trash before the game, but afterwards we are good friends. And let me publicly just thank uh, Dr. Morris for being such a great friend, uh, great partner. Uh, and, and the mentor. We work together well, and so we're, we're excited uh, that we get to share this final moment. And, and just if I can expound on how big this classic is, I was in the airport uh, on last week, and I had my mask on, but somebody still recognized me, and they said, uh, Alabama State, and I said, yes. She was coming, Miss Webster was coming from South Africa to come to the Turkey Day Classic. Wow. Uh, because she grew up across the street from Alabama State University, didn't attend but because it's such a tradition. And yes. so uh, when you talk about community, when you talk about both of these storied institutions uh, and the impact that we have on this community, the region, and even the nation, uh, there's nothing like uh, the Turkey Day Classic. Thank you both for joining us. Yeah. We really appreciate it.